All right, now we're at the post office. We got our slip. We're here about 20 minutes early. They're not open yet. So uh, we're gonna hang out here for a while until they, they open. Probably a line. I'm first in line, so that's good. Probably a line be forming up soon. But uh, we're really excited for this pickup. Really, really excited uh, to be getting these ukuleles. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good one for sure. Hey guys, here you guys can see we have the Enya ukuleles out of the box that we got from the mail, the post office. The accessories bag does have a tuner with a whole bunch of other things in here. And the ukulele also is in here as well. What we did is we took out the tuner, placed the battery in there, make sure they were good, ops checked them, labeled them. So we labeled each ukulele with their corresponding number. So this is ukulele number five. The bag is also numbered ukulele number five. The tuner and the ukulele itself inside there is put with a label on top and it has its number on there. The reason why we do that is so the kids know which ukulele they've been playing with and they don't get mixed up and the fact that they could cross contaminate if there is any cross contamination there. So that's why we did that. We also numbered the accessories bag so it does stay with the ukulele. So this is accessories bag five, but we removed the tuner out because all the other accessories will stay with the activity center monitor that they're not gonna need during class, but they can absolutely go and take to play with if they wanted to. Now I had another unboxing video of everything that we go, went and gone and done already, but that came out really blurry because I had my camera on manual focus and it did not have any anything in focus. Everything was blurry, but we're here now showing you guys that we have all five ukuleles right here and all set to go. The binders are all done. We did the binders and putting the song chords and song sheets and everything else in them. And we're ready to give away these ukuleles to the shelter. Oh, we got the binders. All right, packing up in the car, heading over. It's about a 50 minute drive or so uh, to where we need to go. So we're packing up the Ohana, uh, making sure we got food and snacks <laughs> and drinks for the ride over. Uh, we'll see you on the other side of the island. Hello guys, so we made it. We're out here. There's Chinaman's hat right there behind me. Right in front of me is the Koolau Mountains. Beautiful. They built Jurassic Park over there. Very beautiful side of the island. This is actually where I was born, raised, and grew up. Uh, then moved over to the west side. It took us about 15 minutes to get here. We got it. We're here. We're a little bit early on this side, so we figured we stop off at the beach. Have the kids jump in the water. So hopefully we get some B-roll footage of us flying around this beautiful side of the island. Then in about an hour, we'll head back down the street, head on over to the shelter, and be able to get to the venue. Super excited, super happy. process of getting this one ready to move a new family into we're interviewing cool. applicants right now so really helpful they're made for 
last like 35 or 40 years. So they are, yeah, very, very durable. So this is, this is big it also because this family found a home mm -hmm. to live. Exactly. That's good. Yes. That's always a good exactly. thing to see very vacant. Safe vacant uh, yes. domes, right? That's exactly why, because they found their own place. Our cool. program's goal is for every family to move into permanent affordable housing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, so for any of the families oh. who attend church on campus, they come to this sanctuary wow. to do that. First of all, has six locations. This is our Windward location, so all our families come here. Um, and then during the week, we set up and hold classes in here for a long time as well. So it's been, it's really neat. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it's really neat. Yeah, it's supposed to be a good service. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're all drug and alcohol free um, to be able to stay in the program. When I'm looking for applicants, I'm looking for families who are ready to change their situations. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Well, we can go ahead and grab the ukuleles yeah, and stuff. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's what I Patreons, uh, thank you guys so much. We're allowing uh, any ukuleles to head over to the shelter here in Kahalu. We have Kayla here, who's the program director. Yes, program manager for the shelter here in Kahalu. Thank you so much for your donation towards our program. Our kids are gonna be so excited, but our program is specifically for single moms who have minor children living with them. So we're so excited. The kids are really bored with COVID and they're really gonna look forward to learning how to play ukulele. So thank you so much for your investment into our program. Thanks guys. Thanks. 